What's up ladies and gentlemen, we are back live once again and today I just uh, got a package in the mail and made a silver purchase and so I figured that I would uh, show you guys what I got. Uh, it's not that much, I got uh, two pieces of bullion and some junk so uh, I'm going to try to keep this video short and show you what I got. So I got two maple leaves and this is, or these are my first entry into the wildlife series. This is the Cougar from 2012. Obviously have a higher premium than the regular Maple Leafs. And they seem to appreciate in value rather fast. I think the first one that, the first uh, piece in the wildlife series, I forget which animal it is, is uh, worth about $80 now. Or s s between $60 and $80. Um, so yeah, uh, definitely uh, looking to collect these. So this is the, again, this is the Cougar. And I also got the moose. So, also from 2012. Really nice coin. Definitely recommend it. So, definitely collect all of them. Even though they are kind of expensive. So, that's that. And I also picked up four 90% halves. So we got two Walking Liberty halves. They're both 1942 P's. I'll show you this one. Has some toning on it. A little worn. But I'll take it. Bought these from Provident Metals. And so I've, I've seen these. Uh, they advertise all these different half dollars that they have on their website. So I figured I'd pick up uh, one dollar face value of these, and I got two bends. Well, this one, this one has more detail. Looks like it was cleaned from initial inspection, or on initial inspection. And I also got two bends. This is a 1958D for Denver. It marks on the top of the Liberty Bell, right underneath the E in States. And a 1952D. So definitely happy. And, uh, you know, didn't buy that much, but it was uh, just. Uh, as much as my budget can allow. So, uh, so just want to make that quick video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe to support the channel. Like this video. Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think about this silver. And then we'll see you all next time. Take care, everybody.